Now, as you can see, it hasn't taken very long, really, for us to get a career, recruiting career website up for our real estate office. We basically set up our free blog through WordPress.com. Uh, we added some pages. We added a couple of widgets where we could pull some videos over from VodPod and so forth. And I just want to show you some other flexibility and things that I've been able to do uh, very quickly with my new WordPress blog recruiting website. So if we select on About Mayfield Real Estate, you can see I've added some copy about Mayfield Real Estate and a little bit about our company. Uh, under Great Opportunities, I was able to add a photograph, insert a photograph, and add some other information. Of course, we could get as um, detailed and as um, add as much information as we want. And then under What to Do First, actually added uh, some information uh, where I inserted a video from YouTube that I'd put up on the website where we can actually talk to them and explain to them about the steps they need to go through to get their real estate office. And so um, that's very easy to do under the Add Pages and Edit Pages, and I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So our first step is to go up to the dashboard and go back into the Council of RE Brokers blog website we're working on. Next, select Pages. Once we're into the Pages uh, area, we want to edit one of the pages. And let's just edit the Great Opportunities pages. And I want to show you how I added the photograph. It's very easy to do. Um, and if you're adding a new page, basically I just had my cursor in the workspace here. And right up here next to Upload Insert is an Add an Image button which is what I selected. You can select images from your own file or in this case I actually just took the image from a URL and I copied the URL that's the uniform resource locator that's normally when you find an image on the internet right up here toward the top in the address bar you'll have an image URL if you highlight that right click your mouse and copy you can come down here and then select the image URL, right click your mouse, and paste. You can give it a title, uh, you can give it a caption and so forth, and of course that's not an image, that's why we're getting a little X there. If it was OK, it would put a green check mark there. And uh, you can also uh, select an image that you have at your media library, and you can see we have the WordPress header there. But in this case, we've already copied the image, and that's how I created that photograph image. Now, I'm going to jump over to Pages again, and this time we're going to go over to the What to Do First page, and I'm going to select Edit and show you how I inserted the YouTube video. Um, you can see we just need, a, again, it's another URL. So we just simply select Add Video. It's a real easy, painless uh, way to do this. You can, again, add a video from your own computer. Although you are limited in space, you can upgrade, do a video upgrade for a small fee. But in our case, we already uploaded the video to YouTube for free. So I'm just going to click From URL and I can get the instructions right here. If I go out to uh, YouTube, I can get my URL, right click my mouse, paste that URL, and then insert that into the post. So that's how easy it is to add videos or photographs to your um, blog, or your WordPress blog. It's not very complicated. And again, you can add audio sound files as well. You can add text. Uh, you can actually even add hyperlink. Uh, so if you want to hyperlink to another website, to your company website, you can do all of that right from within the dashboard and the word processing software when you're in the pages menu. And I'll just go back over there very quickly so you can see that. We'll go into Great Opportunities and select Edit. And all of that can be done right here in the WordPressing dashboard 
Again, if I wanted to add a hyperlink, I could do that as well. And just so much more if I want to add quotations, bullet points, numbering, I can do all of that from within the pages menu. So very easy to add photographs, videos, audios, and a whole lot more to your pages to kind of really spice those up and give them a unique flair and the look and feel of a regular web page.